Helps if I turn up my microphone before I start trying to speak. <laughs> hey there, everyone. Time for the Friday stream, as usual. Now, there, there was a little bit of news that I got both this morning and earlier this week uh, that kind of made me want to do something on the stream before we get straight into Skyrim. It'll just take a minute. Uh, the Doctor Who community lost two actors this week, and it was kind of rough. We lost um, Deborah Watling. She played Victoria from in the second Doctor era. And then we lost um, Trevor Baxter, and he played Professor George Lightfoot in uh, The Towns of Wang Chiang during the fourth Doctor era, but also in Big Finish um, in the Jago and Lightfoot spinoff series. So for them, I give a sonic salute. Just let you know that you will be missed. And sad to see them go. But yeah, hopefully we don't lose any other Doctor Who actors anytime soon. But it's always rough whenever the community loses someone. Now, with... With that taken care of, let's get into Skyrim, shall we? Now, we were going to Winterhold. Uh, i got to wait for it to load up for you guys. There we go. Uh, we were going to Winterhold. Um, I'm going to not allow myself to be distracted by the murder mystery that is going on in Windhelm. I'm going to come back to that later. Because someone really wanted me to get to Winterhold. One of our regulars that pay, that now watches the VODs. Uh, but, you know, that's because they can't join us anymore. Stuff happens. Uh, but they really wanted me to get there. So since they've been loyal and stuff like that, I go, okay, yeah. Let's, let's make this one about getting there. So I've been looking at the map because, again, the maps don't seem to be helping me any in this game, so the one big one that kind of you could fold up, I've looked there. There is a path. I think that path would be accessible from where I am, but I just got to look at it to make sure. Yeah. Also, this now has all of the Skyrim expansions in it, thanks to... Yeah, it's up there. I'm not going to go up there to grab it. Uh, but a friend of mine found out that I was streaming Skyrim, so in order to help me out, he decided to be nice and just give me his disc that has all of the expansions in it. So I am able to play Skyrim with all of the expansions inside of it. Now how that's going to affect my gameplay... I actually don't know, because I don't know what all the expansions do. Um, I know one of them makes it to where I can build a house in places that I want to and stuff like that. That's not going to happen anytime soon. But otherwise, we'll, ju we'll just have to see now, won't we? So. thinking appears to be panning out is that I just gotta walk from here and away we go <sighs> glad to be on a Friday guys I'm serious it's it was one of those weeks we we had a rush at work there was a lot of overtime going on I didn't my medical condition keeps me from doing overtime thankfully and not thankfully you know that sort of thing but, oh, hello, boys. Come on. I have contracted rack joint. Fantastic. <laughs> okay, next temple I go to, I'm going to have to take care of said rack joint. Um, I don't know what rack joint does. Put away my sword so I don't make this person nervous. Important deliveries to make. Okay, no time for chatting. That's for whenever he gave me that letter and I was up there. Okay. 
Oh dear. Yeah. <laughs> we just gonna get started with this, are we? Okay, fine. Or I don't know, it may be too far off in the dit now. We are totally gonna deal with this. That's what I didn't do while we were in town. I didn't, well, one, sell some things, and two, figure out if there were any potions makers in that place. If he picks a fight with us, then we'll have to deal with it, but otherwise, let's see if we can. totally dealing with that dragon once we get close enough because yeah it's gonna notice us and it's gonna strike oh oh no 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 that's just coming off of that i thought we might have stumbled upon one of the burial grounds again and that's our buddy up there Yep, that's our buddy boy. There, he's resurrected. He's over there. Last of the charge, but definitely worth it. Gotta find some more of those words of power that we actually want to use. Sheesh. Oh, we. Oh, hello. There she comes. Scared of Ram.
bats are noticing me because they are in that keep. Wow. down there to get him. Yeah. Where'd you... I suspect Liddy will take care of him. Is with me quite yet. Cheese. Oh, the potatoes. Manipulators. Dear. So that was going on. Was this the second time I've <laughs> interrupted someone being bizarre? <laughs> Lydia, but I'll take it. Yeah. 
Yeah, speaking of that, I still need to head back up to Solitude at some point and see what the update on that whole situation is. So many things to do. So little time to do them in. Helps if you do this. <laughs> Same note all of them got. There we go. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire hunters or something. In the old fort near Riften. Might consider joining up myself. Ooh, Dawn Guard. That sounds familiar. That's one of those updates that I downloaded.
man, that thief didn't know what hit him, did he? <laughs> he got in the middle of something he really didn't want to get in the middle of. Or she. Couldn't quite tell because it was face down. have arrived in Winterhold. Fantastic. We need to wipe them out before things get worse. Oh yeah, it is night time. Nothing's gonna happen in this city. The Imperials think we need their laws. You there! You're the one they call Dragonborn! Yes, I'm Dragonborn. Your lies fall on deaf ears, Deceiver. The true Dragonborn comes. You are but his shadow. When Lord Mirak appears, all shall bear witness. None shall stand to oppose him. Time to die. Whoa, okay. <laughs> Find out who sent the cultist. <laughs> Winter hold below. Put that down. Cultist orders. Board the vessel Northern Maiden docked at Raven Rock. Take it to Windhelm, then begin your search. Kill the false dragonborn known as Whaley's before he reaches Salsling. Return the word of your success, and Merak shall be most pleased. Hmm. Let me guess. Someone stole your sweet rod. about Riftham being cold. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's 
now we've got vampires that have been added, and someone believes I'm a false dragonborn. Hmm. Fun, fun, fun. I trust you're not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, Fred? Stay out of My job is to serve the Jarl, not waste time talking with travelers. What do you do around here? Me? Nothing. And I hope to keep it that way. The Jarl is convinced I have some connection with the college, so he goes easy on me. Maybe you'd like to help me keep up appearances. Old Nelikar has a major staff in his room in the Frozen Heart. It'd be good to have that staff. In case the Jarl starts wondering if I actually have a real connection to the college. Forget it. Daedra, take you then. I'm looking for work. Got any leads? The Jarl has put out a bounty on the dragon that's been terrorizing the countryside. Here, take a look at this decree for details. Until next time. What's your business here in Winterhold? I'm here for the college. Hmm. Should have known. Not that it matters anymore. No one bothers coming to Winterhold for any other reason. You're the Jarl. I'm looking for work. Winterhold has lost much of its history, and with that much of its power. I aim to change that. I've heard rumors of the resting place of the Helm of Winterhold. The very same helm that Jarl Hansa wore in the First Era. Hansa was in line to be High King of Skyrim, you know. Having that might get the ear of the other holds and give me some authority. I'll recover the helm. Good. I'll have a sum of gold waiting for your return. I'd like to know more about Winterhold's history. What's there to tell? It's mostly gone now, thanks to those damned mages in the college. Someday there'll be proof they caused the Great Collapse. Most of the city just dropping off into the sea. That doesn't just happen. You have a problem with the college? I do. And if you count yourself among their numbers, then you've blood on your hands as well. There's nothing left of Winterhold. Nothing. Everyone knows it's the college's fault that the sea swallowed our city. Still, they deny it. But we all know the truth. Good day. My job is to serve the yard. Frozen hearth. <laughs> I'm sorry, could you describe the smell? Like some horrible monster just came from the ground and then exploded. What did you do? The mages don't. I've already corrected it for future experiments. This. This is why people have a problem with your college, Nelikar. If there's anything you need, just let what me know. What can you tell me about Winterhold? I'm afraid there's not much to be said. Winterhold is hardly what it used to be. You can talk to Birna if you need to buy anything. He doesn't have much, but could certainly use the coin. 
And then there's our little inn. Most of the business we get is from folks here to visit the college. Though even that's dried up some. Are any rumors lately? People say there's someone in Riften that can change your face. Make you look completely different. Do you believe that? Overheard something about a college? That's right. College of Interval, just north of town. Hard to miss. Good day. I don't deal with any college applicants these days, so don't You're bother with the asking. College? No. Gods no, not for years. I left Winterhold for some time and returned to stay here at the inn. Why would you live here at the inn? I still have research that keeps me busy, and being here in Winterhold ensures I have access to former colleagues. Mm-hmm. Oh, for goodness sakes, Lydia. My days at the college are long behind me, but I prefer to stay close by. The Majors won't let us go into college. They say I'd imagine not. Me and the guards, I'm afraid, happened, Kim. Watch what you're doing. I do what's necessary so we can get by. Have to, since I can't count on my brother for anything. Why set up shop here? It wasn't by choice, I can tell you that. Options were in short supply. Branmir and I grew up here, and nearly any money I make, he drinks away. Without the coin to pack up and leave, I decided to take to trading. Do you get much business way up here? Very funny. I'm sure you've noticed that Winterhall isn't exactly overflowing with people. So I'll sell whatever I can. If it's worth putting a price on, you can bet I'll do it. I've been burned a few times, made a few bad deals, but mostly I come out on top. You said something about a bad deal? Yeah, it was stupid of me. I shouldn't have believed the story and just refused the trade. But I didn't, and now I'm stuck with this worthless junk. What was the story? Some line about this clothing and Ingol Barrow. He said it was worth more than its weight in gold if I took it back there. Something about placing it back in Ingol's chamber, I don't know. What was I thinking? Even if it were true, I'm not setting foot in some ancient <laughs> tomb filled with who knows what. I could look into it for you. I don't even care anymore. You want to check it out? Fine. I'll sell you the thing for 50 gold, and then it's your problem. I'll take that claw for 50 gold. Fine, here you go. You get killed on account of this thing? It's not my fault. Got it? But I suppose if it does actually turn out to be worth something, let me know, will you? What do you got for sale? Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Nothing for health, unfortunately. Coral dragon All right, then. So now I have another cave to get to, which will, you know, have a shout in it. That, that one's... That's 
one's not even questionable. You know there'll be a shout in that puppy. Cross the bridge at your own peril. The way is dangerous, and the gate will not open. You shall not gain entry. What is this place? Oh, forgive me. Most who arrive here do so because they have heard of the college beforehand. This is the College of Winterhold. A safe haven for mages in Skyrim. A place of wisdom and arcane knowledge. Why are you out here? I am here to assist those seeking the wisdom of the college. And if, in the process, my presence helps to deter those who might seek to do harm, so be it. The more important question is, why are you here? May I enter the college? Perhaps. But what is it you expect to find within? I seek the knowledge of the Elder Scrolls. Do you? It is true, there are some here who have spent years studying the accumulated knowledge of the scrolls. But what you seek does not come easily, and can destroy those without a strong will. It would seem that the college has what you seek. The question now is, what can you offer the college? Oh dear. Not just anyone is allowed inside. Those wishing to enter must show some degree of skill with magic. A small test, if you will. Would you grant entry to the Dragonborn? Dragonborn? It's been so long since we've had any contact with the Greybeards. Do you really have the voice? I would be most impressed to see that. <sighs> Your so the stories are true. You are Dragonborn. Normally, you'd need to show some aptitude with one of the schools of magic, but you... I think there is much that we can learn from each other. I think you'll be a superb addition to the college. Welcome, apprentice. I'll lead you across the bridge. Once you're inside, you'll want to speak with Mirabelle Irvine, our master wizard. Please, follow me. The infamous... College of Winterhold. Oh, okay. I'll bet if I tried to go past her without her lighting that up, that wouldn't have went well. The college is an asset to Skyrim, even if it goes unnoticed or unappreciated. to have some masonry work on that thing. <laughs> I've made myself rather clear. Yes, of course. I'm simply trying to understand the reasoning behind the decision. You may be used to the Empire bowing to your every whim, but I'm afraid you'll find the Thalmor received no such treatment here. You are a guest of the College, here at the pleasure of the Archmage. I hope you appreciate the opportunity. Yes, of course. The Archmage. Better not get me sick. Welcome to the college. I was told to come see you. Another new student. I'm surprised at how many of you there are lately. Well, first you'll need these. While you're not required to wear them, you may find them more to your liking than your current clothes. I'll give you a brief tour, and then we'll get you to your first class. 
Are you ready to begin? I'd love to have a look around. Wonderful. Please follow me and don't wander off. The College of Winterhold has been a fixture in Skyrim for thousands of years. The prominent feature here is the Hall of the Elements. It's our primary location for lectures, practice sessions, and general meetings. The Arcanium is located above the Hall, and the Archmage's quarters above that. While technically in charge of the College, the Archmage's responsibilities often keep him occupied. Thus, I run the day-to-day -day operations. Now, if you'll please follow me, I'll show you the living quarters. Unfortunately, we've had to implement more stringent entry procedures due to some problems with the local Nords. We don't anticipate any real violence, but it never hurts to be prepared. Our newest members are housed here, in the Hall of Attainment. I'll ask that you please keep your voice down while inside, as others may be working on research or delicate experiments. It's like a tutorial at the college. <laughs> Now I'll show you to your quarters. You're going to be sharing space with your fellow apprentices, who you'll meet shortly. This is where you'll be staying. This bed and desk are yours. Please try and be considerate of others. Now, let's go back to the Hall of the Elements, where most of the members gather for lectures and study sessions. I might take this part of the game kind of seriously, actually. I'm here studying the Elder Scrolls, I might as well study some other stuff too. Initially you'll be learning from Tolfdir, one of our most esteemed wizards. Tolfdir is likely already addressing the new apprentices. Go on in, and if you have any problems, let one of our senior members know. Welcome, welcome. We were just beginning. Please, stay and listen. So, as I was saying, the first thing to understand is that magic is, by its very nature, volatile and dangerous. Unless you can control it, it can and will destroy you. Sir, I think we all understand that fairly well. We wouldn't be here if we couldn't control magic. Of course, my dear, of course. 
You all certainly possess some inherent natural ability. That much is not being questioned. What I'm talking about is true Better not get me sick. Mastery of magic. It takes years, if not decades, of practice and study. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Please, please. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Eagerness must be tempered with caution, or else disaster is inevitable. But we've only just arrived here. You've no idea what any of us are capable of. Why not give us a chance to show you what we can do? You've been quiet so far. What do you think we should do? Safety should be more important than anything. Well, your classmates certainly seem to disagree with you. Oh, don't listen to him. We can do it. Just give us a chance. All right, let's settle down. I suppose we can try something practical. In continuing with our theme of safety, we'll start with wards. Wards are protective spells that block magic. I'll teach you all a ward. We'll see if you can successfully use it to block spells, all right? Would you mind helping me with a demonstration? Are you at all familiar with ward spells? I don't know any ward spells. That's all right. I can teach you a very basic ward, one that's enough for the purposes of this lesson. Now, if you just stand right over there, I'll cast a spell at you, and you block it with the ward. Here we go. Over there. Please. Just up. Magic. Oh. Just me. Wouldn't want anyone else. Away. What you learn here will last you a lifetime. Several, if you're talented. Now. Cast the ward spell and keep it up. It's no secret that Perhaps I call it his reputation in Skyrim is tainted. I don't want to hurt you. Over there, please, just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Now, cast the ward spell and keep it up. Hold still. Excellent work. Well, I think this is an excellent start. I'd like you all to continue practicing with wards, please. I think perhaps we're ready to begin exploring some of the various applications of magic throughout history. The college has undertaken a fascinating excavation in the ruins of Sarthol nearby. It's an excellent learning opportunity. I suggest we meet there in a few hours and see what awaits us inside. That's all for now. Thank you. No offense, but you're not looking so good. Are you feeling ill? Enchanting services are one of the few things that keep us in touch with the rest of Skyrim. New here too, eh? I'd hoped I wouldn't be the only Nord, but I should have known better. Why aren't there many Nords at the college? Magic is shunned by most. If it can't be swung over your head and used to crack skulls, most Nords want nothing to do with it. Magic is seen as something for elves and weaker races. No offense, of course. Well, look at the evidence. Nords generally don't trust magic, so it's not off to a good start. Throw in the Oblivion <laughs> Crisis, which was caused by magic yeah. users, and the troubles now with the Aldmeri Dominion, who are elves and magic users. And finally, take the fact that the college is the only thing left standing after most of Winterhold was destroyed. It's all fairly damning. Is it difficult being away from your family? Not at all. I consider it a blessing. My family was convinced coming here was a death sentence, or worse. It took years of insisting that this is what I'm meant to do. All right, then. You are new, yes? Have you mastered the expert level destruction spells yet? Not yet, but I will. Ah, this is good. But Jezargo will know them first. It is good to finally be around mages who may be able to keep up with Jezargo. You seem excited to be here. Oh 
Oh, yes. Jezargo hopes to find things that will make him a more powerful mage here. Hopefully small things that fit inside pockets and will not be noticed if they are missing. Ah, one that makes this one's race look... Uh, anyway. You seem very sure of yourself. There is much for Gisargo to be sure of. There is skill in magic, there is charm, and there is a strong will. Gisargo will be successful. Of this there is no doubt. Why did you become a student at the Bard College? Or not Bard College, Mages what the heck's wrong Mages and Ceredin are all about politics. <gasps> The Synod and the College of Whispers are too busy guarding secrets to bother to teach. Skyrim was not Gisargo's first choice, but Winterhold is removed from politics. Dedicated to study, this is the place for Gisargo to become great. Not everything is a competition, you know. Oh, but you are wrong. The only reason you could disagree is because you are losing so badly you cannot see it. <laughs> May you walk on warm sand. You are relatively new here, are you not? I have noticed you, but we have not spoken. No, sir. Sir? <laughs> How quaint. I am Savos Arin, Archmage of the College of Winterhold. I am quite content to see nearly any aspect of magic explored and investigated here. But I do not and will not approve of any research or experiments that cause purposeful harm to your fellow members of the college. Are we clear? Dangerous research must be a problem here. Not often, no. Some risks must be taken, to be sure. I am simply trying to avoid untimely deaths. We also must make an effort to avoid worsening what Skyrim thinks of us. What's the purpose of the college? Purpose? I should think it's self-evident. Magic is a true power. Not something to be shunned by commoners, or treated as an amusing diversion by politicians. It shapes worlds, creates and destroys life. It deserves proper respect and study. The college is a place where we can focus on that, without the pressures of the world weighing down on us. I'd like to know more about the college's history. I've seen documents dating back to the late Second Era. Beyond that, it's hard to say. Events in the last several hundred years resulted in a significant loss of our history, I'm afraid. What happened in the last few hundred years? The Great Collapse, as it has come to be known. An unfortunate natural disaster that ravaged the area. The college fared far better than the city of Winterhold, but it was not left untouched. What caused the Great Collapse? No one is sure of the cause. Some believe the eruption of Red Mountain had far-reaching consequences that were only felt years later. I know there are some who have blamed the College, said that we were responsible. I assure you this is not the case. Tell me more about the Great Collapse. The sea of ghosts practically came alive. No one was expecting it. Monstrous waves battered the shore for weeks on end. Winterhold was ancient and weathered, but it couldn't withstand the sea's fury. Entire districts of the city were lost overnight. The waves receded in time, but the damage was irreversible. Most residents of Winterhold abandoned what was left of the city. The college survived, and so here we remain. Uh, until next time. Another new apprentice, I see. Are you of the sort that believe you're here to change the world? Or are you only in it for yourself? I assure you that I shall be watching you, all of you, very closely. I'd like to know more about the Thalmor. Now that stability has been established between the Dominion and the Empire, we seek only to help Skyrim. To guide its people through this yes, time of transition. No what I to know. help lead them to a better future. What is it you do here? I am an advisor to the Archmage. The Thalmor wish to promote relations with your college. 
I am at the Archmage's disposal if he requires advice. Hmm. Does the Archmage often ask for advice? Perhaps not as often as he should. In time, I believe he will be more trusting. <laughs> Watching all of us closely, huh? I forget, does sleeping take care of... I, I did this experiment way back whenever I got that one disease. But I can't remember if it helped me or not. You are now in the Arcanium, of which I am in charge. It might as well be my own little plane of oblivion. Disrupt my Arcanium, and I will have you torn apart by angry Atronox. Now, do you require assistance? Is there any college business I can assist with? If you're feeling adventurous, I'm always looking for someone to procure valuable books from some more dangerous locations. I'm ready for some adventure. Well, all right, here. I scribbled down the last place I had heard about. Check it out, but be careful. This is quite an impressive library. A mage is only as good as what he knows. I try to make sure as much knowledge is available as possible. We've been keeping this collection since the Second Era. Books have come and gone during that time, but it's mostly intact. What have you got for sale? Please make sure your hands are clean before touching anything, all right? You take your work very seriously. Of course I do. If I didn't, most of these books would have been burned to ashes or dissolved to nothing before the Third Era. Mages need to be reminded to be careful around research <laughs> materials. Are there any special books you're looking for? As a matter of fact, there are. Have you ever heard of Shalador? Immensely powerful mage, back in the First Era. Had an understanding of magic few have ever matched. He holed himself up in Labyrinthian, and devoted all his time to research and study, but more than you would imagine possible. Since then, his writings have been scattered all over Skyrim, but are little use to anyone who can't translate them. I'm one of the few who Ooh. can. I've heard whispers of more of his work having turned up. If you can track it down, it may prove useful to all of us. Okay. I'm looking for an Elder Scroll. And what do you plan to do with it? Do you even know what you're asking about? Or are you just someone's errand boy? Of course I do. Do you have one here? You think that even if I did have one here, I would let you see it? It would be kept under the highest security. The greatest thief in the world wouldn't be able to lay a finger on it. What about the Dragonborn? What about... Wait, are you... Were you the one the Greybeards were calling? I'll bring everything we have on them, but it's not much. So don't get your hopes up. It's mostly lies, leavened with rumor and conjecture. Fight well. Here you go. Try not to spill anything on them. Effects of the Elder Scrolls. It's highly not on it. I don't want to see you treating any of these books poorly. Huh, Are we clear? Not.
This one's interesting. Hundreds of years have gone into assembling this collection. It's going to stay pristine. This ruminations book is incomprehensible. Aye, uh, that's the work of Septimus Cygnus. He's the world's master of the nature of Elder Scrolls. But, <laughs> well, he's been gone for a long while. Too long. Where'd he go? Somewhere up north, in the ice fields. He said he found some old Dwemer artifact, but well, that was years ago. Ugh. You know what we have haven't to heard do from now, him right? since. Find Septimus Cygnus. You need a book? You talk to me. Otherwise, you're going to find yourself in a lot of pain. <laughs> I like him. He is a dang good librarian. And the man's got a tankard on him, just for the heck of it. So I realize he's an orc, but still. You look a bit peaked. You sure you shouldn't be? If you require assistance with summoning techniques, if you would, please also contain your summons to the college grounds. The locals do not need to be agitated further by Atronachs roaming their town. The summoning of undead is even less advisable outside the college. Summoning undead isn't frowned upon. I sure no. Those archaic policies died out with the Mages Guild, and were never enforced here. Necromancy, as any other type of magic, is a tool to be used. Of course, non-mages may not see it that way, so we don't go around flaunting it. Are there any conjurers outside the college? Not within society, no. Many who practice within the School of Conjuration do so on their own, secretly. Thalion is the only one I know who is public about what he does. He was once my teacher here, but left the college years ago. Why did Thalion leave the college? He didn't like the Archmage. Hated dealing with him. Hated having to answer to him. Thalion said he hated what this place was becoming, so he just left. Aaron found a note on his desk, and that was it. I understand he settled down in Hjalmarch, and his presence there caused something of a problem. Mm-hmm.
got a lot of quests in this building, and I think I'm going to work on some of them. one's mine. <laughs> Vampire dust, ray teeth, voice. <laughs> Whoever was here first left me some stuff. <laughs> rest for 12 hours. It's lies, all of it. I don't care what she told you, it's all lies. Who are you talking about? Feralda, don't act like she didn't say anything. I know her, and I know what she's been up to. What's your problem with Feralda? My problem with her? She's the one who has a problem with me. She's threatened by me, by my skill as a wizard, by my elegance and posture, by my superior good looks. But she is not going to get the better of me. Oh no, I won't let it get to me one bit. That's what she's after. She's trying to undermine my confidence, make me doubt myself. Well, it won't work, I tell you. What do you know about Akrana? Don't trust that one. He's up yeah, to something. Yeah, I figured that. Most here are up to something, of course, but in his case, it's not good. I haven't figured it out yet, but I will. He is rather handsome, though, isn't he? Until next time. Okay, let's see here.
those two. Because I have completely forgot. I'll sell just about anything. I do what's necessary so we can get by. Have to, since I can't count on my brother for anything. Good thing I'm recording this because I'll get to look back later and actually find out where the heck she told me to bring this dang thing. Cause I totally forgot right now. Let's see, we are further up in here now. There's the Shrine of Azura, there's... shall I deal with first? Uh, Sarthgall. And then that's probably my main one right now, right? Aha! Because we have to go to Hobbs Fall Cave anyway to find that helm. Turns out the flute is also in said helm, which means it's not going to be, or in said cave, which means it's not going to be easy to get the helm or the flute because way too many important things are inside of that cave. Well, <laughs> we might as well, shall we? Let's go to Hobbs Fall Cave. Might stop by something all on the way, too. That may be where she meant for us to take the claw, actually, because it being one of those, it would make sense. Oh, well. 
We'll find out if we get there. Anyway, for now, away we go. Where is it? There you are. Watch, boys, you're not going to see this anytime soon. Or you three. I swear, every wanderer who shows up in one room looks weaker than the last. Companions. Okay. Until next time. Those three are companions. Gotcha. the companions are doing up here. Yum. Oh, wrong bear claw. Okay, gotcha. Uh, 
Ice Wraith Essence. Interesting. Yeah, they were fighting something else up here and I just happened to stumble upon it. There's some different business going on. Oh, this is the place where they're having the dig and everything. So yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe. Meanwhile, I'm here. I am tempted, but no, I made a decision and I'm going to stick with it. Plus, now that I've discovered it, I can just pop right back to it whenever I want. We're averaging at least two dragons per thing. I have not really thought about this beforehand. Whenever I was just playing this as a, you know, not streaming thing. But seriously, we are averaging about two dragons per week with this. Which means there's a lot more in this game than I thought. Which means there's probably a lot more dragon shouts in this game than I thought.
clairvoyance is having one of its things on us again. But hey, we're having moments at least. should just be waiting for another moment for that but i mean i'm being impatient right now sorry <laughs> Oh dear. Yeah, there's blood splatters all over the dying place. the flute to necromancers which happens to be the same cave that that helm is in <laughs> whoo gonna be a fun day today ain't it kids <laughs> I've weirdly dropped some frames today and I'm not sure what it is I think my net connection might just be acting goofy today so any little hiccups that you've noticed, I apologize for that, but it's just weird. They have skeletons patrolling. Why wouldn't they?
and suspect what we're gonna come down with is a Lydia. Didn't even have to hit him. Okay. Um. Okay, it's time. Okay. that the whole time. I'll be dying if I was just paying more attention. Saving before I get into this room, I just have the strangest suspicion. Big rooms usually mean big fights.
Helm of Winterhold. Found it. Found the flute. Found a Dormoon helmet! Now I got the full blown armor set, I think. follow my own path of destruction back out of here. <laughs> this cave was fairly linear unlike some of the rest of them so I should be able to make my way out of here. circled around. So much for straightforward. <laughs> forward. should be a way out in the other room and I just didn't find it.
Ruin. Here we are. Now, first of all, items, apparel, dwarven helmet. Ha <laughs> Now I got the whole set. I think armor, boots, gauntlets, helmet. I think that's the whole set. Ah, uh, let's see here. So where do we go first? We go to Winter Hold. Let's go to Winter Hold first. <laughs> Good advice? Question mark? <laughs> for the pile. And then I'll take this opportunity to go back to solitude because I have to drop the flute off anyway. so good. Are you feeling all right? Ours is the only family left that truly cares what happens to Winterhold. If you know any true sons and daughters of Skyrim, tell them to head to Windhelm. Ulfric Stormcloak wants to see them. really know anyone at the college. I guess everyone just assumed I do because I'm a Dunlop. No, Winterhold used to be the seat of power in Skyrim. I have now the helm of Winterhold. Can you believe that this hold used to contend for the throne of the High King? Now, perhaps others will listen. Here, your reward is promised. You have Winterhold's thanks. Anything else you need, my Jarl? There is room in my court for a new thane. It's an honorary title, mainly, but there are a few perks someone like you could make use of. However, I could only grant the title to someone who is known throughout my hold. You help my people, and I'll make you my thanks. It would be an honor. Good luck to you. It's going to be the same as the other one. Okay. I don't really know anyone at the Oh, what happened? People won't say, but they're afraid of it. They leave me alone. Now over to solitude. 
One star. Yeah, I'll go to the Blue Palace because it's right down the road from that. So, and then after that, although I could go to Azura's Temple because then, Azura, no, whatever. I'm running all the options through my head as to what I can do. I might just pop it back down, go to the same temple I always have been using to clear up stuff like what I have, and then, you know, carry on from there. There is a temple in solitude, however, like that says, so I could totally go to it and probably get this crap taken off of me if I knew where it was. But I honestly don't know where it is, which makes it a problem. Seville Stentor has a grasp of magical theory that I would never have expected from a human. It's been my honor to perform at the Blue Palace on many occasions. His late lordship was quite the admirer. I recovered your flute. That's it. Wonderful. I knew I could count on you. I don't have any money to give you, but I can show you a few tricks I learned from the winter hold Now you can say you've met the most talented bard in all of Skyrim. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Found it. They actually what did they found find? it. Rion's drum. Nobody knows where he died, and therefore where his drum might be. Haldir was the missing link. Rion entered Haldir's cairn in secret and presumably died there. Now all I need to do is find someone to get it. Wait, you. <laughs> you could do it. I need you to get me that drum. Who's Rion and why do you want his drum? <laughs> You're joking, right? Riorn, only the most famous battle drummer of the Second Age? Well, famous among bards, at least. That drum has been in half a dozen famous battles. It's a priceless artifact. Riorn was always looking for new stories to tell. It seems he was writing a lay about Haldir when he vanished. That was the missing clue. I suppose I should return to my papers.
Welcome to the Bard's College. I'm so glad you got back from Olaf's tomb, okay? They gave you a tough task. So I'm trying to figure out where that temple would be. Just pop right back down to where I always get my healing done. Down to White Run.
probably got us a little bit over an hour remaining of this. How about we go to a dig? Well, let's level up, then go to a dig. <laughs> Part, that's part of that expansion, too. I remember now you can adopt kids. If you wish, that is. Good to see Skyrim still has such fine people. You give an old man hope. What's so important about this place? We're particularly interested in the prevalence of magical seals placed on the tombs here. It's rather unlike anything we've encountered. What are we looking for? Anything. Anything at all that might be of interest. That's why I adore this location. We have no idea what we're going to find. And if along the way, my message about the dangers of magic should <laughs> yeah. kind of sink in for a few students, that would be a happy, a happy coincidence. coincidence. Okay. I'm ready. Let's go. All right. Please stay close to me while we're inside. It should be safe, but it's always better to be cautious. I'm not so sure we should be here. Yeah. As some of you may know, Sawthor was one of the earliest Nord settlements in Skyrim. It was also the largest. Sacked by the elves in the infamous Night of Tears, not much is known about what happened to Sawthor. This is an exciting opportunity for us. Well, are there any questions before we begin? I don't have any more questions. What would you like me to do? Ah, yes. Mm. Well, why don't you see if you can assist Arniel Gain? He's one of our scholars, here working on cataloging our finds. I expect he'd appreciate some help in locating any additional magical artifacts here in the ruins. Any enchanted items will do. 
the usefulness of the enchantment is irrelevant. If you find anything, the mm. class can look it over. Now let's see. What shall we have the rest of you do? Brelina, my dear, why don't you search for warding magics? Anything designed to keep people out. Don't interact with them, just identify them. Bonman, please search that area over there. See if you notice any residual energies, alive or undead. Gisargo, what shall we have you do? Ah, why don't you verify that we're the first ones here? Look for He's setting them all up. The tombs. All right, everyone. Let's be careful, but have fun. I'm not seeing signs of any warding magics at all. Maybe they're not here. Please be careful here. The site isn't entirely secure. Just have the slightest worry that he's just setting the other ones up. That was nice, so yeah. Jezargo finds nothing but dust in these ruins. This treasure here. Don't touch anything. <sighs> Talvin there sent me to help you. What? Ah, yes, you. I remember you. You're going to help? That's fine. Just, just don't make a mess of my work. I've only looked through a portion of this section. You, uh, you can look around in the chambers just north of here. Try and be careful, all right? We don't want to damage right. anything. What do you know about Okano? He asked far, far too many questions about my research. I think the Thalmor are trying to steal my work. I haven't told him anything, of course. What I'm doing is far too important. Can't breathe a word of it. Uh huh. What in the world was that racket? Is everything all right? I'm trapped in here. How in the world did that happen? Pulled an amulet off the wall. Really? Perhaps the amulet is important somehow. Is there some way you can use it?
Some kind of resonance. You and the wall. This is highly unusual and very interesting. Why in the world would this be sealed off? What is this place? something from me hold mage and listen well know that you have set in motion a chain of events that cannot be stopped judgment has not been passed as you had no way of knowing judgment will be passed on your actions to come and how you deal with okay. the dangers ahead of you this warning is passed to you because the Sigic Order believes in you. You, Mage, and you alone have the potential to prevent disaster. Take great care and know that the Order is watching. I... I swear I felt something rather strange just then. What just happened? Some sort of ghost or abstraction. Apparition appeared. It spoke to me. I'm afraid I didn't see anything. Can you tell me more about what you saw? I said something about danger ahead, about the Sigic Order. The Sigic Order? Are you quite sure about that? That's very strange. And danger ahead? Well, that doesn't make any sense at all. The Sigics have no connection to the Orders, and no one's seen any of their order in a long time. Perhaps we should take a look inside these coffins. Now, please do be careful. Who knows what we're going to find? What's the Sisic Order? They were a group of mages with a history that predates the Empire. Very powerful, very secretive. No one's seen them in well over a hundred years. They vanished, along with their sanctuary on the Isle of Arteum. I have no idea what connection they'd have to this place. Why is the Sigic Order contacting me? I have no idea, but it's fascinating. Assuming it's true, of course. The Isle of Arteum disappeared over a hundred years ago, and no one has seen them since. And yet now, suddenly, they've chosen to contact you? Why, it's intriguing. If nothing else, I'd take it as a compliment. The Sigics have only ever dealt with those they feel worthy. Until next time. never seen anything like this in Nordic ruins before. Why, just look at all these coffins. This bears closer inspection. I'd like to stay a while and examine this. You, however, should press on. See if you can find whatever this vision of yours mentioned. But if it is truly dangerous, be careful. Go on ahead. 
I'll be sure and catch up with you before long. Be prepared to defend yourself. Take care now. Kind of annoys me that I didn't grab those other little artifacts before I grabbed the one that was clearly displayed on the wall, but didn't think about it. Friggin' nowhere. I also need to recharge my sword. Suspect I'll need it. Look at that armor. I get by I get why World of Warcraft players like get their character, get all of the armor of set, all that stuff. Cause I've totally done that with this dwarven armor now and I'm loving it. Clues around here somewhere. Okay, it's right behind him. Gotcha.
goodness. That is way too open for my... Kinda, kinda expected that to happen. Cause I don't assume that doing anything to that other than stepping on it is gonna stop anything. Oh, it's one of these. And that moves these by one. So... This one doesn't change for anybody, so I got this. I got those two exactly where I need them, so. Step on that. Which 
And something very specific is about to happen and he needs to be there for it. Oh dear. I'll get you. I got no idea what you are, but Yeah. What is it? Uh, what is it? <laughs> Kind of an apprentice. Be prepared to defend yourself. Take care. This is what is this thing? Fascinating. I have no idea. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing. The Archmage needs to be informed immediately. He needs to see this for himself. I don't dare leave this unattended. Can you return to the college and inform Savo Saren of this discovery? Please, hurry. Bonus, where are you? You're down there. Aha! I should have guessed. Given what this place was, right? Steel plate of the Major Knight. Your Thum freezes an opponent solid. Ah, okay. Interesting. Fire, ice, yeah, that's definitely one. Plus I got nine dragon souls. It's not like I'm hurting for any, so. I'll spend a soul for that one, yeah. I really hope this isn't about to go down the road of, you know that you're one of the favorites of the Academy, blah, 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 you know, that sort of thing.
There you are. Probably don't need to tell the others. I know. Just sneak my way out. <laughs> Incident in Morthal was just a misunderstanding. No matter what the guards claim. He's got a fancy place. I like this. Anyway. What you... It's no secret that the college's reputation in Skyrim is... I need to speak tainted. to you about Sarathal. Ah, please don't tell me that another one of the apprentices has been incinerated. I have enough to deal with right now. We found a sort of orb. Talar wanted you to see it. I... see... I trust that Tolfdir will provide a more specific explanation. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. Tolfdir normally looks after your little group, yes? Since he's apparently occupied, and I will need to see this discovery for myself, I think perhaps you should begin researching the subject. Speak with Urog in the Arcanium. See if he's aware of anything that matches your discovery. And good work. The next time you find yourself exploring Nordic ruins, perhaps this will be helpful. Have you ever met with the Sajic Order? Personally? No, not I. One of their number used to advise the Archmage when I was but an apprentice here. But that was a great many years ago. Before all the members of the Order were called back to the Isle of Arteum, and it disappeared entirely. Mm hmm Oh no! I'm encumbered! Darn you, Archmage! <laughs> you have unintentionally vexed me! <laughs>
to sell that one piece of armor. Or something. That's my heaviest bit right now. So over encumbered. What's that other thing he gave me? The mage light do. Staff of mage light. Ball of light that lasts 60 seconds and sticks where it strikes. Huh. Nice. I don't want to see you treating any of these books poorly. Are we clear? Hundreds of years have gone into assembling this collection. I have a few things laying around that weren't worth adding to the collection. You may look through them. Oh, he's only going to deal in books, huh? Fight well. Wrong place. Wrong place. Dang nabbit. Yeah, I had a feeling that was going to be the case. Okay, fine. Been far too easy, right?
never noticed she was holding that black skull gem before. Now I do. No, wait, that's not a soul gem. That's the end of her. Anyway. I'll sell just about anything if it's worth my time. Keep that in mind, will you? I do what's necessary. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. I'm gonna get a message from someone mm. later. I have the suspicion for doing what I just did, but. Nice little interaction. I didn't expect them to build into it. I was looking up, so that was. Hey, Lydia. Okay. Yeah. Now that we're not over encumbered, let's see here. Items. Two sixty six, three twenty. Yeah. I can work with that. For now, anyway. I don't suspect I'm going to be carrying something very heavy through this research. glitched. There we go. <laughs> Hate it when I do that. You can usually figure it out if you just look. There you are. I've been trying to find you. I just wanted to let you know that Ancano's been asking about you. Oh, I think dear. he's looking for you. Why would Arcano be looking for me? I'm not sure. Just, well, mind what you tell him, all right? Mm, is there a problem? No, no. Well, I don't think so. Between the two of us, there are rumors about him. That this advisor position he has is a sham, an excuse. That what he's really doing is spying for the Thalmor, trying to feed them information. Whether it's true, I can't say. But it never hurts to be a little suspicious, does it? 
Thanks for the warning. You're welcome. Any advice you'd like to give about it? Destruction spells? Certainly. Destruction spells come in different forms, each useful for various purposes. Concentration spells can be cast immediately, though they're weaker. Good for a tight spot and less costly if you miss. You'll also need to decide whether to devote yourself to a single type of spell. Focusing solely on flame spells will make them more powerful, but you may find yourself at a disadvantage against foes immune to fire. It's been a pleasure. I don't want to see you treating any of these books poorly. I need to learn Are about something we found in Sharathal. I know what you want. Word travels fast around here. Discovered some big mystery, huh? Well, you don't even need to ask. No, I don't have anything for you. Not anymore, anyway. You don't have anything that can help? I said not anymore. Orthorn stole a number of books when he ran off to Felglow Keep to join those summoners. Some kind of peace offering. I think one of those volumes may have had some relevant information. If you want them, you'll have to talk to Orthorn. Doesn't anyone care that Orthorn stole things from the college? Not enough to bother with. Archmage Aaron's approach to these things is just to let them sort themselves out. Although now it looks like you'll be doing the sorting. Good luck with that. Who is this Orthorn? He was an apprentice here at the college. Not very skilled, but got involved with a group of mages who took a liking to him. When they left, he took off after them. Stole supplies and books from the college. I suppose as a way to ingratiate himself. Why are these mages in Felglow Keep? Let's just call it a difference of opinion with the college. They were interested in research that goes outside the bounds of what the college allows, so they were persuaded to leave. Mm hmm. Oh, crap. Here we go. You there. I have questions for you. You were in Sarthol, yes? It has come to my attention that something was found there. Yes, we did. I just informed the Archmage. I am well aware. Tolfdir is still in Sarthorn, is he? I shall be expecting a full report from him when he returns. Why does this matter to you? Something was discovered in Sarthorn that was significant enough that Tolfdir sent a new member of the college alone to deliver word. That sounds precisely like the sort of thing that should matter to everyone, especially me. Thank you for your help. You may go now. <laughs> Didn't give me the ability to be cagey enough, so... Pretty much didn't give him anything he wanted to know except, well, what he already knew. <sighs>
for it to do one of these things. Oh, there you go. Five will keep. Um, yeah. Travel to the towers. Man, he made a long way, a long trip, didn't he? Um, no. <laughs> there we go. Hold it. This here's a toll road, see? You're gonna have to hand over, say, 200 gold if you want to use our road. How about you let me through and I don't kill you? Huh. Tough talk for someone who's about to have their guts spilled. Farewell. Ah!
Okay, that's something important, but I don't know what the heck it is. A new hand touches the beacon. Listen, hear me and obey. A foul darkness has seeped into my temple. A darkness that you will destroy. Return my beacon to Mount Kilcree. And I will make you the instrument of my cleansing light. Please don't... Please don't be a Diedrich thing that ends up being... Oh, anyway. It's not this I should be able to do it. That's the problem. I don't know um, all the lore of Skyrim to where I couldn't know if this was a Diedrich god just saying that they were that or not, but I'm hoping maybe, just maybe. But anyway, it is three o'clock, so once we get out of here, I'm going to save this. Side note, one of my Lydia deaths actually happened here. For some reason, she had glitched out and just walked herself right off of this bridge into that. Yeah, it, it wasn't pretty. It wasn't pretty at all. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Forgetting where to go down. Well, I'm annoyed now. Where are the steps down? Oh, wait, they're out here. <laughs> totally forgot. Oh, 
thing. Okay. There we go. The break of dawn. Gotcha. Okay. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, it is time. I am wrapping this one up. Um, if you want to follow all of the other Let's Plays and stuff, go to tscn.tv slash play if you want to find all of those archived things, including our Zelda Let's Play series. We're getting really close to the end of that one. Kind of exciting to go to our next one. Um, if you want to follow all of the live streams, then go over to twitch.tv slash tscnsam. You'd be able to find that. And if you want to find all of the places to get a hold of me, go to about.me slash labtech7 in order to figure out that. And finally, like what we're doing around here, consider becoming a patron, and you can do that over at patreon.com slash tscn. So, until next time, play on, and see you guys. Okay.